Howdy y'all, it's your host Road. Welcome back to Love It Games. We're playing a little bit of a Marvel Spider-Man Remastered today, so I hope you enjoy. Please like, comment, subscribe, share the video, and tell me what you think in the comment section down below. We're going to go hit up some research stations on our way down to the actual main mission. Let's see what we can get into. And hopefully we can have some fun doing this. It's been several days since I've played, so... I never did this research station I was at. Now, well, I'm going back. Ask what I think of Mayor Osborne, but what matters is what you think. Let's ask our first caller. You're on with J. Jonah Jinks. Hi, I think Mayor Osborne's doing a trip. America's renowned pristine drinking water, but it doesn't always get out without a lot of work. The station designed to ease that burden. Yeah, we didn't this do the is research. One of my labs that monitors water quality. Any nasty stuff gets in, it tells you. I wanted to check on it myself, but there's just never enough time. Feels like Harry's not telling me something. I hope he's okay. That algae's already killing fish. And if I don't stop it, it'll work its way up the food chain fast. I whipped up a virus that'll attack it in Harry's lab. But I need a sample of the algae to make it work. Gotta get to the lake, stat. Got it. Now I need to crack the cell walls, and the only way I can do that in time is with G-Force. The quick and dirty way to apply G-Force is jump off a tall building, and the tallest one around is Oscorp. I wish I could do this in a lab, but there's no time. How high do we got to go? Press L to die for 100 meters and swing out. Woo! Got it! Now I just have to do it again. I am not eager to repeat that, but I have to. I don't know if any of these are 250 meters. And we'll go with the Marvel building, or the Avengers building. This is the highest building I know of. Back to the lake and turn this loose. Got an itchy web finger. And we're almost there. There. And it's tailored to the toxic algae. Won't hurt normal plant life. Which is good, because a park without plants is just a vacant lot. You don't got Spider Man. Spider Man don't even got Spider Man.
Research, research station requires the electric web. We don't have that. this one. Looks like the health of New York's pigeon population. Harry Osborne and Oscorp, what's up? Seriously, your pigeons are our number one vector of atomic communicable diseases, a station that helps us keep tabs on our winged friends before they become health risks. Okay, Pete. This lab has feeders to lure in birds and analyze their droppings. Yeah, that's right. I got an MBA to test bird poop. <laughs> Seriously, though, you probably know that birds carry diseases that affect people, and we need to make sure they're healthy. You know, I really wish I was there to hear your finest toilet humor on this one. Uh-oh. The pigeons are infected with a serious strain of avian flu, and it's already mutated to a form that can spread to humans. Okay, Harry's lab had everything I needed to make a vaccine. Gotta spread it fast, or the pigeons will be like rats with the bubonic plague. My best bet's dispersing it at three major migration points. Luckily, the station told me where they are. First migration points in a park. Birds there should spread the vaccine to their buddies. Pigeons put up with me swinging through their territory. So I owe them a favor. I bet the Avengers never have bird poop missions. Ah, uh, I bet there are a few. Tony Stark does do some crazy stuff. Seems airborne, so I'll just spray it into the trees. Okay, one down, two to go. The spray won't bother people or other animals, but it'll cure the pigeons. Or trigger the zombie pigeon apocalypse. And one more left. I wonder what Jameson will make of this. Spider Man spreads chemtrails, seems like a good bet. Pretty much. I like helping animals. They don't call me a menace or shoot at me or anything. I wonder if it'd be stretching things if I added veterinarian to my resume. Hey, that should work fast. I'd better scan some pigeons to make sure. That did it. No zombie pigeons. Tesla fed pigeons here, and so did Harry's mom. I remember her bringing us. I wish I could tell Harry, but 
He's not answering calls, texts, anything. We'll run over and try to do these the research stations over here. Then we'll go and do the main mission. Gotta back up one of these things is least important subject of a project right up until the most important. The station helps us manage the overflow data from other stations. Back up for our backup. Okay, so this station collects overflow data from all the others. Yeah, God forbid we waste Oscorp's server space. Anyway, do me a favor and make sure it's running smoothly or everything these stations do is for nothing. This isn't nearly enough server space. It's close to overloading. That'll trigger a purge, and everything Harry has will be lost. I can't let that happen. Wait, ESU has a backup server near here they never use. That can handle the excess data, but I'll need to realign the transmission dishes to make a link from here to there, fast. The active receiver's easy to find. Just have to get... Okay, now to find another link in the array. Got it. Just have to keep doing that. All right. What's taking up all that space on Harry's servers? Looked like DNA sequencing, but that seems beyond the scope of the research stations. Um, there we go. Focus, Pete. It won't matter what's on the server if it all gets erased. systems in New York would be a nightmare. Oh, I don't see anything. Oh, wait, there it is. Should be in view of the ESU server now. Initiate the data transfer if I hurry. Uh, that doesn't rotate. Good. How are you supposed to? Oh, it's going around. Okay. Hmm. Looks good. Good. Mm -hmm. 
Let's see. Like so. All the marbles. It's working. Everything stored successfully. Should be fine until I have Norman assign Harry some more server space. And he'll be glad to when he sees what the stations have been doing. Norman doesn't really care. The only one I think he would have wanted was the invisibility one. To be honest. The station is kind of my answer to Oscorp's hopefully soon to be discontinued chemical weapon research. Systematic counter agents to some of the world's most dangerous chemical agents. Of course, doing that analysis requires the use to keep samples of said chemical agents in here. Okay, be careful in here, Pete. This station analyzes hazardous chemicals, and basically trying to figure out how to counteract them if they ever got out into the world, which. <coughs> Hopefully, they never will. Oh no. Someone broke in and stole a volatile rocket propellant. And they must have cracked the container because it's leaking. From the timestamp on the security cameras, it just happened. I need to get it back. My spider bots are still just prototypes, but this is a good time to test one. Its sensors can follow the chemical trail. Better than me swinging up on the thief. If he freaks out and drops the hydrazine, gotta find a quiet place to deploy the spider bot, where I can hang out and guide it. I actually think this would freak people out more than the spider bot. It's leading me right to the thief. Spider-Pot. Thief's hiding in crowds. I'll disperse him with a subsonic blast. Won't hurt anyone, but it's super annoying. I'm not Steve. Lucky this stuff's only dangerous over a long exposure. Or if it combusts. Maybe. Maybe not. Spider bot, spider bot. And whatever a spider thought does. End of the trail. He's he's running. Gotta wrap him up with a web burst. Got it. Now to get the fuel back. Got it. Now I just need to return the fuel to the station. This little spider bot's useful. If I can ever find a way to make them cost effective, they'd be a big help. It's cost effective as long as they don't get destroyed. Back where it belongs, I beefed up the station security and sent Yuri the camera footage to convict the thief. Not a bad day's work. This is one station that was already earning its keep. It should be safe from being shut down, especially now that the chemicals are locked away. Yeah. Uh, there's a few more research stations in the They honestly don't take that long. Like, we are whipping them out pretty good. Honestly, we probably can upgrade some stuff. Uh, 
Okay, the stuff in the station revolutionary. It can't get, or if we can get it to work. Engineered bacteria that dissolves plastics into harmless component parts. Really hope we can work out the kinks. This is one of Mom's earliest projects. We were trying to develop a bacteria that would dissolve all the plastic in the oceans. But we, um, well, she ran out of time. Like, if you have any ideas, it would really mean a lot. Hmm. With some genetic tweaking, I might be able to crack it. But I need a better equipped lab. And the bacteria only lives in liquid environments. Wait, my web fluid. I can keep the bacteria alive in my web cartridge. Yes, you should have the chemicals I need to increase its power. Oh man, the bacteria dissolved my web. It's in the cartridge for the webs I swing from. The other kind should be okay. Now I have to get to ESU without swinging from anything. Whew, the zipline webs seem fine. Well, I'm getting a heck of a workout. And now I'm gonna have to run through New York. I don't know how long this bacteria stays viable. This is good practice for if my web shooters ever malfunction. Spider Man. Excuse me, come in there. they have to dispose of their chemicals in these containers. Should be some stuff I can use. All set. Now I have to get to Dr. Octavius's lab to combine everything. That's far I'll away. Just take the subway, but the bacteria won't survive that long. My bad. Not allowed to drive faster than me, I'm Spider Man. I actually really like the dark colors of this spider suit. It really like sticks out. Hot stuff coming through. Seriously. What's up, dude? Hey, stitching on that costume's pretty good. All right, here we are. Now I just need to grab the bonding agent. Hey, it's a bunch of HP, G2, G1, and G3 desktops. And a Dell, up top. Got a motherboard, two motherboard, three motherboard. And now the industrial centrifuge that'll get the bacteria out of my web fluid so I can store it properly. Unknown substance found. Just need to isolate the bacteria. All right. That one and that one. No, don't need that one. What do you need? 
at that. Beautiful. You can have Vorax bacteria. I think I improved the bacteria. But I can only tell for sure back at Harry's research station. Eta. Should have my web swinging back. Let's see. That's what I'm talking about. Oh, sweet web swinging. I'll never take you for granted again. Yeah, you will. I hope this works. I Human remember nature. when Harry's mom started the project. It meant so much to them both. Where there's a web, there's a way. The actual idea and concept of web slinging like this would be so much fun. Especially in an environment like New York City. There's the testing receptacle, full of plastic. Let's see what happens. It's working. Not as fast as I'd hoped, but better than before. Probably needs further testing. I didn't get all the plastic, but it's a big step forward. Enough for Oscorp to keep working on it. They'd win the Nobel Prize. And it wouldn't hurt their stock price either. Alright, go over here. It looks like one, two, three, four. Four more research stations in this area. There's the two that we can't do with. We still have to figure out what a challenge token is. We haven't encountered them yet. Funny, you're just like in the bathroom taking a poo and you see Spider Man run up your building window. Kind of esoteric, but this station monitors the city's cell tower network for potential vulnerabilities. People never think about it, but those cell phones we carry in our pockets pretty simple for a rogue agent to weaponize them if not careful. 100% true. Hey, Pete. This station's one of my pet projects. I always thought the cellular network was vulnerable to terrorist attacks, so I set this up to monitor it. Can you do me a favor? Look for anything suspicious? Uh-oh. It's not terrorists, but there's a glitch in the system that's causing interference. And if I don't fix it, it'll bring the whole network down. Right now, it's only affecting the most sensitive equipment, like mine. I need to stay outside the areas of interference while I fix the cell towers. There. I set my lenses to show me the danger zones. Gotta fix the cell towers before the whole city's comms go down. Hey, I've gone to uh, the upper guard. The problem area fluctuates. I need to be ready for a sudden change. I've gone to the upper guard uh, conventions, where they do some hacker testing and whatnot. They're able to read our government IDs or credit cards, or cell phones. One down. But I'll need to fix three more to solve the problem. They're able to read all the information of this stuff. So much depends on cellular networks now. A crash would affect police, hospitals. It'd be as bad as a blackout. Gotta hurry. Soon the whole system's gonna go. Uh, but yeah, it'd read all of our IDs in our pockets. The crazy thing was the government IDs, but were encrypted. We were able to sit in the crowd and they just tell Gosh, us. The job's only halfway done. 
Tell us who's where, what they have in their pocket. Oh man. It was always I wish crazy. There was a way to fix this for everyone except people who use their phones in movie theaters. The problem's getting worse. I'm running out of time. Invisible walls closing in. I feel like a mime. Got that one fixed. Bought me some time, but I can't slow down. Can't waste a second. Getting to be a tight squeeze. Oh my God. Okay, let's not do that again. We're gonna have to because we didn't get enough height. can share their domestic disputes on the subway again. And emergency services are safe, which is, you know, also important. If the network had crashed, it would have cost Oscorp a bundle to fix their comms. They'll want to keep this station up and running. Harry's project should be safe. All right. Yeah, the hacker conventions are always fun. I've always wanted to go to DEF CON. A bunch of my friends this last year went. They said it was a blast. Unsettling reports of Spider-Man in our public parks, where children play, apparently, stalking pigeons. Yes, wild pigeons. You may wonder if he's gone insane. A perfectly valid question, but have you heard... Nope. This station monitors air quality, it's more precise than anything in place now. If those were more widely adopted, we could make huge leaps in life the entire city. This station's simple, but really important. It measures toxins in the air, way more sensitive than anything the city has. Bad air hits children and the elderly first. This was a big one for my mom. If his data is accurate, there's way too much sulfur dioxide in the air. I have a spidey hunch this is caused by inefficient engine exhaust. If I get some fresh samples, I can identify the make and model and report them. <coughs> okay, got that one. <coughs> oh, this can't be good for me. <coughs> you should have an air filter on your costume to begin with, just because of certain villains you go with. Nice. <laughs> Just need a few more samples. Oh, 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 that one smelled. <laughs> Just a couple more. <laughs> Got it. Or should do it. <coughs> oh, don't die, don't die. Oh, I wasn't high enough. We have three guilty parties. I'll need to get pictures of them for proof. Taking pictures. Just like the old bugle days. Life was so much simpler back then. Not too bad. One's an old box truck. Wow. 
Why isn't it picking up? Why can't I? Or for camera. My camera is just not working. Okay, that's odd. Okay. Looks like we have three guilty parties. I'll need to get pictures of them for proof. Taking pictures. There it goes. Just like the old bugle days. Life was so much simpler back then. Check it out. That's a keeper. I wonder why it was not working before. See of your earth friendly neighborhood Spider Man. We smog alert. The rest of these are on the way. Spidey man, you got this. I'm imagining we're going to be getting a new suit here soon. This station monitors water pressure for nearby buildings. Anything goes wrong, pipe bursts or clogs, an alert is automatically sent out to the city's maintenance teams. At least that's what would happen if Oscorp ever pushed the city to approve the system. Hey Pete, so this station monitors water pressure down to the individual building. Structures above four stories use water towers to augment the city's system. The idea is to identify problems before they spread, you know? Whoa, the pressure in this building's all over the map. I need to find out why. The water towers connect to the city's system at the four story mark. I'll scan the pipes, try to see where this starts. Pipes are fine up here. Whatever's causing this, it's lower. Not trying to go that low. Here's the problem. Valve's at the wrong setting. 
Easy enough to fix. That shouldn't have happened. I better seal these fast before Jameson pins it on me. Better than duct tape. Got it. All right. Just call me the amazing spider plumber. Et voila. Really? Just in time. Nailed it. Got last one. Got it. But those won't hold long. Pressure shouldn't be that high. Unless the drainage is blocked. I'll check the outlet pipe. The outlet pipe's down by the waterfront. I'll go see if anything's blocking it. Now I ask, how many other heroes fight crime and fix your shower? And now Oscorp can't deny Harry Station stopped a public utility meltdown. May have stopped a public utility meltdown, but your webs are still the only thing holding eight water tanks from blowing up. Regal. One of the hardest problems with improving air quality is identifying the source of highly toxic low particle count pollutants. Stuff that can make you sick only with a few grams. The station specializes in solving that exact problem by targeting specific particulate toxins. Takes me back to my industrial hygiene class. The station tests particulate matter in the air. Now, you'd probably have some science jargony way to say this, but basically, too much is not good. Hmm, readings are troubling but inconsistent. The only way I'll figure out what's going on is to test nearby emissions. But I've got other problems. The sampler's detecting toxic particles. Better check it out. That's true. That's a good place to start. Industrial hygiene was a fun class. I had a teacher, Dr. There's Charles Marshall, which was belong. awesome. Let's analyze it. So you over here with this one. You with this one. Oh crap, that screws us up on the Oh. Is this one. There we go. Mercury and unknown additional substance. Bonded with something else. I can't tell what. This obviously isn't confined to one building. A lot of people are at risk.
Let's see what a sample from this can tell me. Yes, let us see. Oh. Alright, so you're this one plus this one. Yes, yes, nope, not correct. There we go. It is nitric acid and nitric unknown additional acid in there too, but also something else. I'm on the right track, just need to keep following the trail. This is more widespread than I thought. To Spider Man. Phew, that stinks to high heaven. Time to find out what's in it. Killing me. It'd have to be these two. Plus that one. Yep, there we go. Ethanol. Ethanol. Why is this sounding so familiar? with nitrogen and ethanol. Gotta get back on the trail. When this is over, I'll alert the health department so they can check on the local residents. The ethanol not that bad. Like, it can be treated either. I think I found the problem. Caustic chemicals are leaking out of those barrels and into the plumbing. Need to clean up the site fast. Huh. The calcium and silicon in concrete makes it an ideal absorption material. Looks like I'll have to make a mess to fix this mess. One down. Nice. <coughs> Breathing this stuff in? Not good. <laughs> Gotta stay above this stuff. <laughs> that should be it. Alright, I need you up. You up. L trigger and great. That could have been way worse. 
Harry's research station just proved why it needs to stay open. Dude, what the heck happened to this building? Chocker time! Yep. Herman! Long time no see! Hey, I'm no lawyer, but, uh, I'm pretty sure that's a parole violation. Oops, guess we're stuck in here for a while. Want to play 20 questions? No? How about we thumb rest? Okay, face punch it is. Yeah. Whoa. Your gauntlets are all digital now, aren't they? Have it your way. You wanna fight? Let's fight! Man, can't wait to put you back behind bars so we can talk science. Remember our first fight? Me so young and stupid? You just stupid! You talk so much! Well, that's a matter of opinion. I mean, are there any stand- Also, how would you measure? Word for me- if you come clean, I can help you. You really want to help me? Try to let me have the money. Oh. Sorry, not gonna happen. Coming your way. You know, people don't use banks anymore. You're lucky you found natural cash. If you really want to rob banks, try day trading. It's all the rage. Wait, 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 wait. Oh, no! Oh, come on, Herman. If you tell me who you're working for, I can help you cut a deal. If I talk, I'm dead. They made that very clear. Oh. yourself literally man he was scared and desperate 
These demons are everywhere all of a sudden. Okay, Yuri. Shocker's all yours now. Good work. We have a special cell waiting for him at the raft. We'll make sure he stays behind bars this time. Also, I'm pretty sure he was working for the Demon Gang. Demon Gang? <sighs> Sounds like a Daily Bugle headline. Hey! The Bugle is a perfectly fine news organization. Not sure I'd call it news. Well, I've heard they have some really good reporters. Anyway, have you had any more reports on demon uh, uh, guys with masks? Let me get back to you. By the way, how much of a mess did you make inside that bank? You probably don't want to know. <sighs> Shouldn't have asked. You don't want to know, don't ask the question. All right. Chance to generate gauge refills, plasma discharge, and gadgets. I'll do this one. No, I can't. Challenge token. This enemy's not air and holds them there for a short time. Alright, so that requires two. Fight with Shocker took a while. Time to catch up on what I've been missing out in the city. The only real thing is left are the two that I cannot do. left a message. Peter, I might have been a bit hasty advising you to find another job. I have a plan. Give me a bit of time. We may yet live to invent another day. The indomitable Otto Octavius. That's great news. Hope his plan works. Can't even try to open it. That sucks. Oh, now we can look for demon crimes. That's something new. Hey, so I looked into reports of demons. I knew you'd come around. They've been pretty busy tonight, hitting a lot of Fisk properties. They're going after Fisk? Damn. You thinking what I'm thinking? Brewing gang war? Let's try to get ahead of it. Are there any fist properties that haven't been hit tonight? Let me see. Patrol reported a bunch of activity at one of his shipyards in Portside. Thanks, Yuri. I'll check it out. that shipyard for no idea let me send an officer to meet you there his name's jefferson davis that's his beat he's a good cop been working the fist case for years if anyone knows what's going on at that shipyard it's him we we're getting to where we can do this fast attention units officers are engaged with the demons shots fired back up Requested at port side. Please copy. That shootout's gonna get someone killed. I 
That's it. Everyone okay? The demons fight like men possessed. As our first demon crime thing we stopped, I guess. Alright. Oh, we're right outside of another area. We're gonna call it an episode there. So thanks for tuning in. Please like, comment, subscribe, share the video, and tell me what you think in the comment section down below. See you guys in the next episode. Have a wonderful day. God bless. Peace.